Hey, what's going on, guys? Hey, welcome back to another episode of Bad Beast Barbecue. We're doing a quick cook today on the A Smoke 300, okay? We're going to be trying out this new uh, rub or this rub that I found on Amazon called 12 Gauge Barbecue Pork Rub, okay? We got two pork steaks. When I tasted this rub, it tasted like it needed a little bit more salt in it, but it has some great flavor, uh, nice spiciness, and it's sweet, okay? So what we're going to do is we got two pork steaks today. We're going to season one with SPG and the 12-gauge pork rub, and then the other one with just the 12-gauge pork rub by itself. So, hey, no need to keep talking. Let's get this prep work done and get the cook underway. All right, guys, so we're done with our cook. We pulled both of our pork steaks off of the A Smoke, and they smell fantastic, nice and smoky. Um, they both look great. I showed you a close-up of them as they came off of the smoker. Uh, this one over here is the uh, one with the 12-gauge pork rub on it plus the SPG, and this one here is just the 12-gauge pork rub by itself. So we're going to go ahead and we're going to taste these, and we're going to see uh, which version came out the best, okay? So, we go ahead and cut into the one by itself. Okay. Oh, it smells fantastic, man. That smoke is fantastic. All right, here we go. Okay, just like I thought, guys, the Cajun 12-gauge uh, uh, pork rub, it tastes good. It's got some sweetness to it. Uh, got a little spiciness to it. Not very much, but a little spicy to it. But um, it does uh, have a very good flavor to it. But it's lacking some salt. Um, and I think it needs a little bit more pepper. But it's a good rub, but uh, I think in combination with something else, it will be much better. Let's go ahead and try the one with the SPG on it and the rub. This one smells good also, all right? Oh yeah, that one's definitely it. This one with the SPG tastes much better um, when paired with the 12 gauge rub than the 12 gauge rub by itself. This one here has the right amount of saltiness. The black pepper adds a little, uh, a little more flavor to the pork steak uh, in conjunction with the sweetness and the little bit of heat from the uh, 12 gauge pork rub, okay? Well, the SPG, the SPG version is the way to go, okay? So if you guys are interested in buying this 12 gauge uh, barbecue pork rub, I'll put the link down in the description block. 
I bought this off of Amazon. I've uh, been buying different rubs off of Amazon to try them and see how they taste, okay? And uh, this one here is pretty good. On a scale of one to 10 by itself, I would probably give it a seven and a half um, because I've tasted uh, better Cajun rubs before or Cajun rubs by themselves that taste much better than this 12 gauge by itself. But if you're gonna pair this with some SPG, then I think the combination of the two uh, seasonings uh, is ideal. This pork steak is much better than the one with just the 12 gauge by itself, okay? Well, that's all we have time for. Hey, if you guys are interested in a Ace Smoke uh, pellet grill, I'll put a link down in the description block and I'll put the link up here on the screen. Check out the guys at Ace Smoke. Uh, you can get these grills uh, at different hardware stores. Uh, I know for a fact they sell them at Home Depot. You can buy them offline and they're always on sale. And of course, we use the AS300 today, but I don't know if some of you guys may have seen our testing of the AS350P, the uh, prototype of the new uh, portable grill that's coming out. I'll put an iCard up here if you guys want to check that uh, video out also, okay? Well, that's all we have time for today. Hey, like we always say, where there's smoke, there's fire. And if it's fire, then damn it, there just might be a barbecue there or somebody taking your pork steaks and putting some holes with it with a little 12 gauge, okay? Hey, as always, hey, we'll see you guys around the smoker.